Meanwhile, Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau may be admired, admired for his progressive policies, but his reputation is damaged by scandals back at home. Now, Trudeau has now kicked off a six-week re-election campaign, but opinion polls are suggesting that his hold on power is actually quite weak. Remember, Justin Trudeau had swept to office in November 2015, stressing on the importance of gender equality, gay rights and environment. And he now faces an electorate that is more focused on the economy and affordability when it votes on the 21st of October after the elections were announced. Canadians! Canadians from all across this great country sent a clear message tonight. It's time for a change in this country, my friends. A real change. But Justin Trudeau may not win enough seats to govern by himself after a series of missteps that have called into question his leadership while cutting into his once sky-high popularity. A recent research poll indicates that Liberals at 34.6% and the main opposition Conservatives at 30.7%. And this margin may not be enough to guarantee a majority of seats for Justin Trudeau. Mr. Speaker, for two months the Prime Minister has been avoiding accountability and his involvement in the SNC-Lavalin corruption scandal, which has been engulfing his government now for months. Now, Trudeau's challenge is that he is running on his record rather than the uplifting message of hope and change that had helped the Liberals attract record numbers of green youth and aboriginal voters back in 2015. Liberals, however, have started near-record low jobless numbers and booming growth and lower levels of poverty as grounds for his re-election. The forest fires have triggered smog alert across Indonesia. Now this, as the country is of course seeing an increase in the number of people suffering from respiratory disorders due to the poor air quality caused by what is essentially slash and burn farming practices. Local authorities have shut down schools in parts of the country's Sumatra Island over health concerns. This, as the doctors have sounded an alert especially for children. Asap ini sangat berbahaya terhadap kesehatan paru. Ya, asap-asap tadi yang merupakan racun bagi paru itu merusak pertahanan daripada saluran nafas paru.